Well guys, now here we are with this build with an i5-11700K on an ASRock C590 Extreme motherboard with a 360 Corsair all-in-one cooler. But look at what happens as soon as I start a stress test. Now I just go here, start it, and the temperature will immediately shoot up to over 100 degrees. Now, if you don't want this to happen, or if this is happening to you and you want to fix it, here's how you do it. So let's go straight into the BIOS and let me show you my settings. So here we are in the BIOS. Now you want to go to Overclock Tweaker, or it's going to be different depending if you have an MSI Gigabyte Asus board. And now you're just going to want to go on CPU configuration, which is uh, uh, here, as you can see on the ASRock C590 Extreme we are using. Now on CPU ratio, you set it all core. This is going to give you uh, the same frequency on every core. So, and we're going to set 47. now. You might be saying, but hey, 47 is lower than the 49, 4900 megahertz we were getting before. Well, yes, but before it was throttling. And also that was the single core max turbo boost. It was actually going to around 4.4 um, if it wasn't throttling. So we, we are still getting like 10% overclock. But since it was throttling, in my case, we're actually gaining about 700 megahertz, which is a lot. Now you just want to go on voltage configuration and set the CPU uh, core voltage to fixed mode and set 1.3 volt like this now go on CPU core cache load line calibration set it on level 3 and now just hit F10 and I will show you the results okay now here we are in Windows as you can see it took the voltage um, and now let's actually go and run Prime 95 small FFT the hardest test uh, on the planet and now let's see what happens to our temperatures as you can see 86 degrees maximum so in my case that's about over 20 degrees drop and if we go and take a look at the frequency it's just locked on all the 6 core 12 threads at 4.7 gigahertz on this i5 11600k so yeah guys just copy my settings now remember this was pretty conservative you can actually uh, pretty easily get like 1.275 as a v core or even 1.25 if you want to test it this was just if you want just a quick preset to copy so yeah do that let me know how it goes and see you in the next one guys bye